Hey guys, it's Crystal D. Smith here, and I'm going to do a video to help you connect your Oculus Quest to your Chromecast. I'm going to share with you three things uh, that you can do to correct this problem, and all three of these things are something that uh, we have tested over and over in multiple households on numerous networks and on well over 20 televisions. Um, it does not matter if you're using a Google Chromecast 3 or an Ultra, uh, we did use both of those in our testing environments and they should work just fine. If you own your router and you have issues connecting, try disabling your IPv6. In most cases, that's going to correct the problem and you'll be able to connect without issue. If it doesn't correct the problem or if you'd like to have your IPv6 enabled, then you're going to follow the step of this diagram here, which is essentially creating your own unique network uh, for the Quest-related accessories to connect to. Now this, this can be a little confusing because just because your devices are on 2.4 gig or 5 doesn't mean they're on the same network, it means they're on the same band. So in order to circumvent the issue of the Oculus Quest not being able to see the Chromecast, we're going to give it its own unique network so that we don't have that issue. So take your router modem combo and either wire, uh, wire connect that using an Ethernet cable to an access point or a file hub or connect it wirelessly or it could be wired depending on which one you get to a Wi-Fi extender. So that's step one. And go ahead and set that Wi-Fi extender or that access point and give it a name. I name it Quest just because it's easier this way and there's no confusion there. So once you get that set up and you go in uh, and you look at your network, you should see your network name in both a 2.4 and a 5 gig because most of us have dual, bound dual band routers. And you'll also see the Quest network or the network name that you set up. So that unique network name is going to be what we're going to use for your Quest related pieces of hardware. So now you want to go ahead and connect your Chromecast needs to be done wirelessly of course make sure you have that connected to your TV or monitor by an HDMI cable now when you initially set it up you will need to use your mobile device that you have the Google Home app on that device will need to be on this Quest network during the process of you setting up the Chromecast but once it's set up you can take it off the Quest network after you get the Chromecast set up on that Quest network go ahead Power on your headset and connect the headset to the Quest network. Once you do that, you should be able to stream right to your TV or monitor without any issues. Again, we have thoroughly tested this in a large number of environments that didn't work previously. Um, we gave this information out to quite a few users on Reddit uh, who came back to us that it did work. So again, we feel really confident that this will help you correct those issues. If you have any questions, uh, you have anything you want to contribute or some other fixes that you have found, please leave those in the comment section below if you're watching on YouTube or if you're watching on my blog. Please reach out and share that with me via the contact page or on the blog page. You'll find a list and links to my social media feeds and you can share there as well. As always, thanks for watching.